Hey guys, welcome back and let's talk some test server uh, fun. We got the Lucador here, which is like literally the Aventador of Titans. It's fast, it's crazy. Um, I've got it outfitted with Sender and a Basilic. Got these two huge like boosters in the back. It's just uh, a quick, insane thing. Um, the Cinder makes it particularly horribly fun uh, because of the damage and the fact that it happens within close proximity. It just melts everyone. It's like two portable stoves. Um, and the Basilic, <clears throat> I actually kind of like it. I think it's relatively balanced. I just threw it on because it's kind of a weird mixture, but you can like kind of fire away and like get people from a distance. You see the effect accumulation, everything else there. It's essentially an alpha uh, version of um, the crate. So I'm going to play with some Venoms. You can see the Venom here, level eight. Those are the stats. It's always kind of fun going through these initial stats on test server. Um, I really like this puncher actually. So um, at 500, it hits okay. The accumulation is not still at level eight, 165% and the damage is 1722, which is just like way, way strong, but um, it'll probably miss a lot. You'll probably need like some sort of skill to keep it going. So um, we're gonna also kind of check out this reviver. It's kind of an eh, like, ran an idea type um drone with a bunch of funky chips that can be added on to it so um you know that's kind of the that's kind of the layout of the the test server this weekend you know orochi puncher uh, shredder puncher hawk all right let's see it in action though so uh i'll open up with the orochi because you know it's fun to kind of get beacons and lock people down it's well it's not fun it, it's horrible when you're on the other end but i think the puncher has enough power that you could probably immobilize and also take people apart um slowly after a couple of volleys it does empty pretty fast that so you'll see this um test test server though none of this is like actually going to be what it'll look like when it hits the real thing you just you never know <clears throat> you'll have to part of my voice on this one i've got another cold this week uh so i'm all nasally doing these videos but this test server was way too fun for me to just kind of hold the content i wanted to kind of get stuff out there and get you guys um interested about what's coming in the next update which is actually like only two weeks away so it's it's gonna we only have two weekends before the next event comes out i don't know what i'm doing or what there's like i if you're good at these maps, you could do them backwards, and clearly I just am not good at this map. So, okay, let's uh, switch gears uh, from a puncher over to the hawk, um, puncher-shredder combo. Um, <clears throat> I, I'm still confused as to why the magnetar and shredder exist besides the 100 meter difference. Like, what the heck is that about? But um, I think the reload is quicker on these, and they probably hit a lot harder since you have to get a lot closer than a magnetar um i paired my magnetars on my hawk with dragoons so a shredder plus puncher could be a pretty fun lethal combo um i'm clearly struggling here grandpa shiva is probably not playing on his oh yeah definitely not actually i know i'm not playing i play test server on my iphone this is probably why i'm like struggling my eyes i can't see come on um, <clears throat> the reload's a little, it's, it's tough to get used to. I'm just used to like longer duration with a magnetar. So this is just kind of variable, but, um, oh, hit the, hit the active module there. Yep. Papa Shiva just really does not know how to play his iPhone anymore. Ever since I switched to an iPad, it's been tough for me to kind of get back into the thing on my iPhone. These agent eyes and these fan fingers. Shane. Um... The VFX though is pretty cool. And so the sound effects, everything is kind of like, they, they, this is ready to go. Like, and it'll probably come in some form capacity like this. So expect that. It just is weird that it took like, like three years for this to come out. Like how long has the shredder been out? Like uh, it, it's just weird. <clears throat> but hey, I mean, who am I to judge on development timelines? The company obviously is like resource, resource thin like every company now these days. So, hey, we got, we got a heavy combo. Forget about, I mean, the medium combo but whatever we won't even talk about that um with keeping the distance on the hawk too this is what makes it especially lethal because like you know you're sort of you're basically at the top end of mid-range you're really looking at like uh but yeah if you get close you can see what happens you just you kind of get 
wiped away. So close range webs, uh, let's discuss that too um, after we after we test out this Luka door. Now look at this, just insanity. This is just stupid fun. I love this. This is, I mean, like you're just stoving people to death. You're just like triple kill. Like what the heck is going on here? This this weapon is nuts. The reload's a little screwy though. I don't quite get it. And I'm like, so this, y y your immobility, like double shield mode, reflector mode, um, you can't move. So the description said that you your move is severely slowed down. I, you can't move, which you can see from that so oh well so much for that one um let's try out the revive er which is supposed to give you last jolt of something um quadruple venom this is your next like holy moly like op weapon combo choice on a typhon it's just gonna be like so mean like look at this like i i can melt this lucador is that a lucador i can't even tell the screen so well, that is a little door good lord i can't see anything i really need to get back my ipad i should put tester for an ipad um let's see let it reload i'm gonna wipe it out through three one the reloads fast as heck on these venoms too tester is fun this weekend look at these juicy new weapons we'll get all right so i'm gonna um let's see try to revive myself and see if i can go after that guy yeah froze him let me empty this out the typhon venom will just be like oh my god it'll be so obnoxious it'll be fun <laughs> which i know sounds horrible but it really will be um the dot on it's going to accumulate so fast too you can run it with you know, a medea um as well and get 15 percent bump oh that better be okay yeah so now these yellow things will delineate a cinder so you you definitely want to keep your eye out for that once these come in so the mino cinder let's talk about that is he thanks jerk he just like threw me into the thing with one horse the health power um the the mino cinder will be the uh the titan force that we reckon when they'll come charging at you um and either throw you in an acid pool like this jerk did or uh <clears throat> They could uh, essentially uh, melt you before you could even react. Um, my counter to the Cinder or any Minos for the Cinder will be Muramits. You can EMP the SOB from far away and then melt them with your Vengeance and Crates and Basilix and whatever else. So um, there's plenty of counters. I wouldn't stress about this. Um, but yeah, everybody in the the the, the cinder is going to be the Minos. The Minos will come back. Basically, we we had we saw thousands of them on the battlefield, like whatever six months ago. All right, so we're in Springfield. Let's see if we can. Uh, this is the remastered one too. I I like the old one actually. To be honest, I hit the wrong button. Damn it. Yeah, I, it's I guess the up button means you jump up, and then the other one means you just sit there and fight back this is absurd i think uh this frog hop will probably stay put onto live server <clears throat> so you have a dashing minos and a crashing um lucador and um yeah let's see how that goes i guess for those of you that like beacon rush this will be the bot to like fling around the map with uh let's see fling reflectors on i wonder if you can knock people out oh why did i end up here Let's see. Let's release the cinders. Melt people. Oh, EMP. See, right. I, like what I said right there is the EMP is going to be the weapon of choice to lock people down. <clears throat> the fact that the cinders can melt titans from this, like, that's just crazy. Let's see if I can actually survive this. Uh, mm, yes, I've killed two titans with, like, 10,000 health. That's just nuts. This thing is just stupid nuts. <laughs> all right so uh they're really pimping the springfield map a lot i keep on landing on it it's driving me nuts <sighs> okay venom uh anything whether it's a typhon or a uh demeter that uh you should save silver for the venom if you're upgrading now, unless you're like deeply passionate about it and you like brawling, stop upgrading. Save for Venom, uh, silver wise, and then pray to the gods that you will win one. Or if you're pay to win and just like super, 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 um, whatever, like impatient, like I am, um, 
spend some bucks and get one if you want like this thing is just um it's it's pretty sick and the typhon demeter build will be awesome uh you could do off the shelf builds too you could do like a, a toxin um a toxin venom like uh, raven that could be fun to fly into somebody's face and just melt them <clears throat> especially with the damage increase with the the raven pilot so that's another one but the demeter typhon is like the super simple you got one stop it on so first things first uh if you're like a medium if you've got a lot of bots with medium points and you love brawling this is your build this is your go-to um save your silver now because everybody kind of complains about silver but you have to remember silver gets spent on things that you just kind of get distracted by if you've got a strategy you like brawling you've got and you know a level demeter or a level typhon like just hold off hold the silver we get overdrives now every week so just do that um love the venom for that <clears throat> and the, the the sound effect is actually pretty sick too look at that like you can just melt people from like that far away that's super crazy it's like I, I don't know if i'd shelf my igniters though like that's my like that's what i wonder about let me follow this this guy over here no don't hit me um it's just a different different weapon than the igniter i i think it's about the same damage maybe the venom's slightly more i assume it's slightly more um let's see all right let's get a lucador let's see if i can get the lucador in nope not there yet damn it we shall use the venom titan All right, let's uh, drop that guy and get a Luke Dorian. So, center beacon. Let's see what kind of damage we can do. You can basically fly across the whole damn map. But I'm still trying to figure out that. Okay, so blocking, reflecting that shield, buddy. You, you're getting decimated. All right, let's see if I've got an opening, and I'm gonna go flying over. This is so much fun. I won't lie. The frog leaf is crack. This is so... Okay, now what the hell am I doing? I need to get over there. I need to get your beacon. Bro, do you want that beacon? This is where, like, you see the cinder is completely useless. You can keep distance and lock people. Like, like this bot is going to completely lock me down if I don't make it to this stupid beacon on time. And that's why... Oh, okay, forget the beacon. I'm going to just go over here. Oh... Cinder you to death. Cinder you or not. <clears throat> this reload is really weird. I don't get it. <sighs> Let's see. I'll just jump and hit, hit you. And then release my cinders and kill you. Ah, perfect. Another titan. All right, damn you, dude! I I'm gonna this will uh, like I will jump and kill you. Reflect, reflect. What the heck is this reflect not working? All right, jump. Gonna kill you. Arr, cinder death. Come on, oh, son of a bee! This guy keeps on freaking. All right, I'll just lock. This reflector needs more power. Nope, wrong guy. All right, I'll just shoot you because I have nothing better to do. I think uh, I think the basilic goes beyond the reflection. No, I guess not. Oh well, <clears throat> so much for that. All right, do a little bit of a puncher action. 
I think we got this game. I think it's pretty much a given. Lock this guy down. Lock him. Yeah, the game's over. Okay. All right, so um, I'd say this is kind of a fun bot. It's your next jump in Minos. Um, we'll definitely change gameplay for sure. You're gonna probably wanna probably wanna use your Sharunga to 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 really whatever like what's it called? Use his special ability to like shut him down, as you guys saw in the last clip. Um, I like I like it. I won't lie. I really do. The Cinders, I'm not sold on. The Basilic, I think, would be a good pairing. Um, and remember, I think the Basilic, the damage goes through Reflectors, too. So, all right, peace.